Well, this is the second full day of North Carolina's reopening, and many people are happy to see stores back up and running. But there are others who say the virus isn't gone and it's too soon to reopen. We wanted to check out the pulse of the community today. Nine on your sides, Madeline Ashley is live in Uptown Greenville. Madeline, are people telling you, what are people telling you about the timing of the reopening? Madison, it was a mixed response from people today. Many are excited to see businesses back up and running. Others say we need to wait a little longer. Starting phase one, I think definitely we're we're ready to reopen. I don't. I think it's time to start opening things up. It's just too much still going on, in my opinion. Opinions are varied on reopening North Carolina. Many stores are following Governor Cooper's phase one order, reopening to eager customers. All these businesses, they're hurting. Judy and Paul Cornifel agree phase one is a smart move for the economy. The people need jobs. And we need to get back. The Cornifels say if being in public isn't for you, stay home. I think it's now up to the point where the people themselves need to say, you know, it's my opinion, and as long as I'm not intruding on anybody's rights or anything else, I will do that. Stephen Beckett hopes to see all states push reopening. If we don't start now, like when are we going to start opening the economy? But not everyone agrees. Necessities, yes, but. Everything else, like beauty salons and things like that, no. Kiana Battle has been at Vidant Medical Center for three weeks with pregnancy issues. For Battle, it means protecting those at risk. Well, I mean, if, the, if they think that the virus is spreading through human contact, why would you want to be like that close to people? Medical workers Jacqueline Hope and Latanya Ellis agree moving too fast is a bad idea. Everybody get out there, they're going to pretty much get contaminated with this virus, I think, and they're going to spread it. Hope asks business owners for patience. We know everybody ready to get back to work. Everybody need their finances to pay their bills, but just be patient. Following phase one, stores I saw today still had very long lines outside their doors, making it hard to social distance. Medical professionals are still asking people who are out and about to wear a mask, use hand sanitizer, and of course, try to keep your distance. Live in Greenville, Madeline Ashley, nine on your side.